Good morning. I've decided to make some kind of vlog. This week I'm not really sure what kind of vlog is go this is gonna be. But anyways, I'm quite excited. There's not many people in the lab right now, so I'm hoping that I can film a bit without disturbing and annoying people there. And I'm quite excited. My mom is visiting me from Portugal for with a friend, so I'm excited for that. Also, Christmas markets are opening. I love Christmas and Christmas markets. I will be taking you with me uh, throughout some of my days as much as possible. I got some results that I was waiting for for a long time now and I will be working on that. So there's going to be mainly some computer work, but maybe there's something interesting for you to see as well. Before we start the week, let me explain to all the newcomers what I am actually doing. I am doing my PhD, as you probably already understood by the title of this video. But what is my PhD all about? First of all, we all know that plastic is everywhere. If you look around you this very moment, you will probably find that a great deal of stuff is made out of plastic. For instance, the computer or cell phone which you are using to watch this video is very likely to have plastic in them. Due to the increase in plastic mass production, single-use plastics and poor plastic waste management, a lot of it ends up in the ocean. Plastic pollution in the ocean can have many possible effects in the ecosystems, animals and even human health, which I will not discuss in this video. However, if you are interested in learning a bit more about it, I will link a video somewhere on the screen so you can check that out. But anyways, after just a couple of days of being in the ocean, plastic pieces become the new home for many microbes, such as bacteria and fungi, that attach to these plastics and just don't let go. The interaction between microbes and plastic is really unclear, and that's where I jump in. I am studying these communities, trying to understand who they are, if we find the same ones in plastics collected in different parts of the world, and if they are actually using the plastic for something, for instance, as a carbon source. Additionally, I'm also interested in learning if the plastics affect microbes which are already in the water and thus also affecting associated food webs. So, yeah, very briefly, this was a summary of my PhD. And before we continue, let me just state the obvious. I know I should be an artist. So, now, let's go. Paco, wie geht's? Oi. Ciao, Paco. Ciao, Nina. Ciao, Paco. Cold, but it's actually quite sunny, as you can see on my face. And today is Wednesday, so I'm just gonna have a bunch of computer work to do. Then we have lab meeting. It's where all the lab gets together and talks about everything that we are doing, if there's problems in the lab and so on and so forth. And then in the evening, I have a goodbye party of a really good friend of mine who is leaving Vienna to go to a trip in uh, Asia. Oh my God, I'm so jealous. And yeah, that's about it. alone but I'm not <laughs> in the office so I will not be talking to you much but I will be showing you a bit around. Hi pal. <laughs> very very messy. It is now 20 past six and time flew today because I've been doing a lot of bioinformatics, analyzing these new sequences that I got, these DNA sequences, which allow me to kind of identify bacteria that I have in my experiments or, that, or from samples that I collected from the environment. So I was really looking forward to get these sequences and today I was very excited analyzing all the data. Well, there were a lot of obstacles on the way, as always with bioinformatics, but slowly but surely it's getting there. Now I will stay here at least like a couple more minutes because then I will leave for to for a dinner. This is how my face looks after a whole day in front of the computer. You can see how big my eyes are or like how my eyes get. <laughs> yeah. See you. Good morning everyone. It is Tuesday. 
And yesterday I didn't manage to bring you with me to my friend's goodbye party because I just actually felt like this was his goodbye party and I didn't want to be filming and just spending time with him. Um, but anyways, today is going to be an again another day sitting in front of the computer, just analyzing stuff. I am afraid I will not be able to film as much as I wanted in the department because all the people that seem to have been gone on Monday and Tuesday are all back. So actually now the lab is very, very busy and there's people working everywhere. So and it's really annoying to have someone filming all the time. Also, not everyone wants to be filmed. And uh, it's also annoying to be asking if they want to be filmed, so I have to respect that and I cannot also disturb people's work. I mean, the lab is a working place. So I will try to show you and bring you with me as much as I can. But with that said, let's go into the greatness and the restaurant this amazing Thai restaurant where we always come for eating normally I bring food from home but because yesterday I did not cook I didn't have leftovers from the day before so I just came to our favorite Thai restaurant me and uh, my friend Miguel say hi Miguel hi. <laughs> so yeah now back to work basically one of the last ones leaving it's seven I got really caught up with work I found some really interesting stuff so um, unfortunately I cannot share them with you but I'm happy and now I'm gonna go home and make some lunch some lunch no some dinner and eat and then chill a bit we just had dinner now we will just chill a bit, watch an episode of something, probably John Oliver or Law and Order or something. I guess I will see you tomorrow because now I will end this vlog for today. So, see you tomorrow. Hello. I do apologize for my Friday afternoon after a long day of work face. It's Friday and um... In the morning I didn't do anything different than the other two days before, so yesterday and the day before. And I was just working here at the desk and now I do have a bit of lab work, I have some incubations with bacteria. And just like humans, bacteria also need to eat, so they need nutrients, which I will provide them with now. Join me in the lab. I'm one of the last people in the lab, so I can talk a bit freely now. I'm here until quite late, I was caught up in some analysis and now I still have to add some nutrients to my incubations, which I will do now. And uh, yeah, by the way, welcome to my bench. I'm sorry it's a bit messy now because I was working here, but my life.
office and it's about a quarter past seven so I'm already tired of sitting here for the whole day so I will go home I wanted to go running today because normally I have dance classes on Monday and Wednesday but because I had my uh, my friends goodbye dinner I didn't go on Wednesday so I'm feeling kind of I need sports right now so I will probably go running or just do some yoga at home I will decide when I'm home so let's go home and they say I'm doing a PhD it's really cold so I've just decided to stay home and do some exercises on the floor some yoga and then some extra strength exercises so ready to go this is my balancing exercises doing squats on here doing one for me is like doing 10 normal ones I just know how to go back and forth. No tricks really. agree that the light in my room is terrible yes yeah, see it's either either really creepy or really dark <laughs> let's go for halfway I've had something to eat already I took a shower and I finished some analysis that I didn't manage to finish uh, at the lab and now I am done with the screen, at least for now, maybe later it, in bed, maybe I will watch something, a series or something, or not, I will just read. Now I have my tea here with me, I have my book, and I will now just read and chill. And I'm really looking forward for tomorrow because my mother is visiting me from Portugal. I haven't seen her for a couple of months, more than a couple of months. Yeah, I haven't seen her for some time and she's coming with a friend and I'm really excited to see her again and to go to the Christmas markets which I always adore. I am gonna finish this vlog here for today. Good morning guys, it is Saturday um, and I'm very excited because I'm, I'm about to pick up my mom from the airport and we might go to a Christmas market and then I have to work a bit still today. I am reading the introduction of a friend of mine who is having her defense in January and I'm just giving it a look to see, give her a bit of my input as well. And then I also need to finish some analysis because I'm having a presentation on the 13th of December and there's a couple of things I really want to present by th uh, at this meeting so I'm working for it and there's a couple of other things non-work related coming up which I will take a bit of my time so I'm trying to work as much as possible at the moment so that I can do as much as possible until this presentation go. I'm here with my mom already and we already started the Christmas market marathon. <laughs> we are at the Hot House Christmas Market which is the most busy and touristic market in Vienna but it's just beautiful. I will show you a bit around.
it's Monday and as you can probably see I've just woken up so during this weekend I've spent most of the weekend with my mom and with her friend we were just checking out some Christmas markets walking around Vienna it's a bit, uh, unfortunately it was a bit rainy yesterday so that was not so nice we got a bit <laughs> rained all over but yeah anyways it was a very nice weekend my mom's still here until Saturday, so I will spend the rest of the afternoons with her after work. I'm sorry I'm speaking like this, but um, my next door roommate is still sleeping, so I cannot talk very loud. And yeah, so I think I will leave my vlog for this week here. Um, please let me know in the comments down below whether you like this um, type of video or not, because I will probably not do this all the time but it's, it depends a bit on how much availability I have in the afternoons and also at work if I'm very stressed out but yeah please still let me know if you liked it if you liked it I might do more occasionally whenever I can because they are really fun to do and if you like them it's a double win so yeah I hope you liked it also please let me know about the size of the vlog I'm not really sure how big this is gonna turn out to be because I, I kind of lost track of how much time I filmed already but whenever it is that I'm finished please just let me know if you liked it or not and I hope to see you in the next video thanks very much for watching Ocean People and see you